Ubisoft just decided to change the plans for Watch Dogs Legion and I will talk about everything you need to know about it right here in this video. So make sure to hit the like on this video if you haven't, let's get 500 likes, subscribe and ring the bell for way more Watch Dogs Legion videos and let's get right into this video. There is a very big chance that Ubisoft is showing off the Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline DLC during the Ubisoft Forward event. I will of course like always be live reacting to to the live stream and you can join the live stream by clicking on the link in the pinned comment hit a like on that live stream already let's get 100 likes on that live stream it's scheduled for june 12th it's going to be a lot of fun and i will see you there so although in yesterday's video i talked about helen and how she is delayed as a playable character but ubisoft touched on this today once again and they said it's no more delayed and they're releasing it today as well with the brand new update helen is obviously the grandma we saw in loads of Watch Dogs Legion trailers and you can get her from the in-game store. So her three abilities are fast hacking, we also have summon vehicle, a bogan 25 and there's also low mobility. So yesterday when Ubisoft said that the brand new update for that 5 was going live, it was not live just yet and we still had to wait a few hours. This probably has to do with the brand new Watch Dogs Legion of the Dead game since we know now that it is a different installment so a completely different game so as you guys know Watch Dogs Legion of the Dead is right now only available as a PC alpha version and everyone on the console as well as everyone on the cloud platforms still have to wait till it's here and you might be asking yourself are we going to get a test version as well for Ubisoft to get our feedback it could be the case that we are actually going to get the final version and have to wait all this time for Ubisoft to get our feedback and also change up that mode as well to have a way way better experience but like I said as of now there is no information on that yet so Watch Dogs Legion of the Dead you can get it yourself if you do own the Watch Dogs Legion game itself and it's good to keep in mind that it's an online exclusive you can play it in a single player mode like I said yesterday already but the thing is you can't Pass the game. If you do not own Watch Dogs Legion but you do have a Ubisoft Plus account, you can also go ahead and download Watch Dogs Legion of the Dead for completely free. Yesterday I made an 8 minute video about everything that you can find in Watch Dogs Legion since this update has been massive. So I really needed the time to spread everything in just one single video. And I also uploaded the Legion of the Dead gameplay for those who didn't see that. So July is is going to be the big big month for Watch Dogs Legion where we can see the Bloodline DLC, Aiden Pierce and Ranch as a playable character in the game. We don't have an exact date on when this is going to release just yet, somewhere in early July and that's why I think on June 12th they are going to show off the Bloodline DLC during the Ubisoft Forward event at least a little bit. If you are looking for a channel that keeps you up to date with everything you need to know about Watch Dogs Legion news updates and everything you need to know about the game itself i'm your guy make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't just yet as long as you guys keep supporting these Watch Dogs legion videos i will keep them as short and informative as i possibly can hit the like on this video if you found the video helpful in any way subscribe and also ring the bell for way more Watch Dogs legion far cry 6 horizon 2 and riders republic videos click on the video on your right to see everything that is in the new update. This is me, your boy Cheese. I'm out. Peace.